Well, good morning, everybody. Something possessed me to start doing YouTube videos, and until I get a camera, that's all I'll have to do. Come on, get in. Don't sit on the iPad. So what I've been doing lately, we've been doing utilities over at the basement I dug in November. Uh, I've got the 442 over there doing the electric service. I've got the 331 put in the water line. Uh, right now we're running some errands before we go over there and start digging again. Uh, the fossils are supposed to go over there and help run the 442. We uh, had some scheduling issues and I decided I needed help, so I called Fossil. He's been digging the electrical service for me. Uh, this morning we're going to run down the road here to the neighbors uh, and see if I can't pick up a chicken coop with some pallet forks for him. I've forgot about it for so long like everything else so I need to go look at that while it's on my mind and then we're going to try and put a hose on my new fuel reel and test that out today that ought to be pretty neat I've been waiting for that for a long time the cocaine bear here just along for the ride yeah that looks like what I'm after I ought to be able to pick that up set it on a trailer without an issue especially a deck over hmm. seems easy enough goes Fossler. He ought to be good and ahead of me by the time I get there. We are headed to Springfield now since the Cumberland Electric Engineer called me back this morning. He's got to tell me which way we need to face the transformer box and I was wondering about shoving it out for the electricians to run a temporary so uh, I'm going to get piped to do that now since I wasn't sure and I wanted to get what I could while I knew what I needed. So we'll go see Nathan and get us a Two foot ninety, and then uh, get some fuel. Maybe go get that hose for the fuel reel, and we'll see you on the job. All right, looks like Paul's putting some holes in the ground. We're gonna get in and fire up the three three one and finish this water line. There's the rig. Let's see what's happening here. crossing a driveway with an electrical line. You can see Cocaine Bear there doing his job protecting my truck from squirrels. I'm going pipe together to throw it in the ditch. I got James on the 331 finishing up the water line. We've already backfilled most of this rough. It'll get graded before we leave. And then the electrical ditch being a primary, it's four foot deep. So we'll get that knocked out. There's a swale there curve there because of the swale we didn't want to cut it down so we went around it and then a transformer box and a pull box on the end cocaine bears wondering what i'm doing i better get back to glue and pipe so there's the pull box we set it i'm pushing spoils out of the way so we can dig the government connect lines that go around the pull box since they don't go through the pull box Waiting on the inspector now. Once we do this, we'll be done besides the backfill. And as soon as I get out of this, it's lunchtime. Well, the water line's done. It just needs backfilling. Both of these are done. Waiting on inspection. We're bedding it a little bit. So if it rains, it won't float away. And hopefully, we'll be inspected with a green sticker before lunch. Fingers crossed.
look at that pipe wraps around them. It's all backfilled with the red tape. It'll drain right. It's not smooth, but it'll drain right. I don't have a skid steer on site. 